Hello everyone and welcome back to some more Resident Evil Village. Okay. Um. It sounds like they're back. They are. Okie dokie. <laughs> this time I'm not right next to my desk, so... I shouldn't hit anything, including... Uh, I might hit my... Um, my window. Lovely. So it says... Come on, it's clear! Gonna stop them, especially the big guy. And other people. I'm sorry. We'll be safe in here, won't we? Safer here than out there, that's for sure. Hey, do you know anything about what's going on around here? It doesn't make any sense. Mother Miranda has always protected us. Nobody's answer. Father. <laughs> We have to get inside! He's not going to turn into one of them, is he? Just hold on a bit longer, Papa. Hello? Anybody home? Maybe a familiar voice. Louisa! Open up! It's me, Elena! Stop shouting. You'll draw the monsters. Julian, calm down. Who's this? A friend. Stay back. <laughs> Father, for God's sake, Julian, let us in. No, no, they'll smell the blood. You'll endanger us all. My father will die out here. But that's not my problem. What's going on? These people want to let a dying man into our home. Come now. These people are our friends. Go on. Go inside. Come now. This way. You're not from this village. Uh, no. I'm Ethan. Julian, go make yourself useful and check the grounds. I said go! Well, do as you told, buddy. If Elena trusts you, then so do I. Come inside, Ethan. <coughs> Wait here. I'll check on the others. I just use this. I've been nosing now. 
They broke it again. Got more of the livestock. I don't think we'll make it through winter at this rate. Ernest is still missing too. We can't find him anywhere. Has Mother Miranda abandoned us? Okay, sorry, I'm just snooping. Inside, the others are waiting. What the fuck is this? Outsiders, you're gonna get us all killed. Right, Anton. He helped Leonardo and Elena. We were doing fine by ourselves. Please, Ethan, take a seat. Is this all that's left from your entire village? All that's left. All that's left? There is no one left. A worthless. Invalid, a stupid, wailing bitch, and you, you drag a bloody man and an outsider in here like it's nothing and expect to be all safe. There is no safe. Every sorry bastard out there has been ripped in half. But tomorrow, tomorrow we're all just like her damn husband. <laughs> Put a sock in it, Roxana. That's enough. This house has protected my family for generations. And drunk or not, you are all welcome and safe in here. Whatever. Can someone please tell me what the hell is going on here? We don't know. One day we were a quiet, devout village, and the next, the monsters came and attacked us. And they, they kept coming. Wait, Louisa, where is your husband? Did they? No, N no, he, he is out there, somewhere. He, he, he went to get help. Yes, yes, that's, that's it. He, he went to fetch help. Let us pray for him, for all of us. Good idea, come. Great ones, hear our voice. Together as one in reverence, we call on thee within the endless dark to deliver us into fate's hands. As the midnight moon rises on black wings, so we make our sacrifice and await the light at the end. In life and in death, we give you glory Mother Miranda. Now, the tea should be ready. Come help me, Elena, please. That prayer, I've heard it before. There was an old woman near the graveyard. Give me the hag. <laughs> a bitch as crazy as a bag of rats. There is wisdom in her devotion, though. And I hope it protected her as it shall protect us. <laughs> And again, do it again. I said no. Oh my god. I'm so sorry, father. Hey. Hey. That wasn't your 
father anymore. You did the right thing. Elena, Elena, no! There's nothing you can do! Papa! This entire place is collapsing! No! No! You couldn't save him. He was already gone. Leave me alone! No, we're getting out of here. Together. I gotta get out of here. Oh, yeah, we do, because that fire is coming. Yeah, I did see the car. Just check and see if there's anything else in here. Well, it's going to be like you need to find the keys anyway. Yeah, that fire is very slowly coming through, so let's, let's go hunting for a key. Take the screwdriver out of the key ring if you need it. Nice. Like a brewery going on in there. Damn, the fire's moving fast. <coughs> Back. We can bust out with this. Step back. Game. Didn't work. Ethan, are you all right? I'm, I'm fine. Let me back up again. The fire. There isn't any time. Try not to breathe in the smoke. I know. Thank you, Ethan. <coughs> You're kind. I hope your family is safe. I do too. Once we get out of here, maybe you'll get to meet them. <coughs> That'd be good. Oh, we gotta go up here. I don't think she's gonna survive. Come on, it'll hold. There, that's our way out. Oh, thank God. But what then? The village is still full of monsters. We can't fight them, there's too many. Hey, hey, don't talk like that. We'll find a safe house to put you in until I can find my daughter. My hunch is she's in that old castle. No, that place is full of nothing but blood and death. And I don't want to be alone while you're... Father? Oh, no. Crap. No. 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 He said my name! Father! Wait a second! 
not safe! Uh. Uh. Stay there! Come on! Give me your hand! Ethan, go! Save your daughter! Elena, don't give up! Reach for me! Oh, what happened there? <laughs> Pause, skip, no, I don't know. Well, that broke the moment a little bit. <laughs> oh, I knew she was going to die. Damn it. Watch my arm there. This is happening again. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, I've got a screwdriver. I don't want to move now. <laughs> right, let me just check. Nothing else in here, is there? Death. Yes. Death has visited <laughs> them all.
We're going this way. <laughs> So I've got the two pieces to go in here now, but I've still got things down here that I need to do. And there's places I haven't visited. I haven't been up there. Can I do anything up there? Well, I guess we circle back round to do all this stuff. So, well, that's going to be the Demon Crest, surely. Crows, where are they? Oh. Crows equal money. There's a light down there. Oh, it's a reflection. <laughs> well, hold on. <sighs> what kind of... Lady Thick coming up. That is that just that rock is just floating. That's really weird. <laughs> the text is obviously not right. Oh, I've been hoping that Skyrim VR would come to PSVR too, but it doesn't look like it's going to, so I'm probably never gonna carry on my Skyrim VR game, which is a shame. I really want to carry on that, but I can't be bothered to get my old PSVR set up again. It's been so long. Well, well. Didn't think anyone was left. You must be pretty tough. Huh. Who the fuck are you? Oh, you're not local. Even better. <laughs> Mother Miranda's gonna love you. <laughs> Cool. 
Figure one. We're almost there. <laughs> The man is of no real use to anyone else, and my daughters do so love entertaining foreigners. <laughs> Furthermore, I can show that you trust the more that My daughters and I are delivered to the point. Way ugly! I want to see! <laughs> He's awake! Don't you shut the fuck up! What? Where? You mean you'll screw around with it in private? Where's the fun in that? Give him to me. And I'll put on a show that everybody can enjoy. Oh, so gauche. What do we care for bread and circuses? The man thing's suffering is assured. Yeah, gag, yeah, the man's dick is cut off in the castle, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I've heard all your arguments. Some of you were less persuasive than others, but I've made my decision. Heisenberg, the man's fate is in your hands. Mother Miranda, I must protest. Heisenberg is but a child, and his devotion to you is questionable. Give the mortal to me, and I will ensure he is ready. Shut your damn mouth! And don't be a sore loser! You'll find your food somewhere else. Quiet now, child. Adults are talking. I'm the child. You're the one who's arguing with Miranda's decision. You wouldn't know responsibility if it was well Oh, to keep glory! Him. One day your head might actually fit your ego! Fight, fight, fight! Hey, don't I get a say in this? Silence! <laughs> My decision is final. Remember from whence you came. Then. Lycans and gentlemen! We thank you for waiting. And now let the games begin! Let's see what you can do. Ethan Winters. Get ready. No way! Is there anything in there that I want? <laughs> oh shit, I did not realise these were here. Could have died then just for Too close. Wait. 
Do those freaks have Rose? Oh, I didn't take my gun. That was silly. Previously poor, unfortunate souls. But hasn't this all just like started happening recently? Maybe. I don't know. Just looking around. <laughs> has like what would you call it gear kinesis mechanical kinesis I don't know Oh, they're like actual villagers. Literally taking real people and turning them into scarecrows. That is grim. Times. I've been waiting for you, Mr. Winters. How do you know my name? Anyone who is anyone has heard of the likes of you. A hero searching for his daughter. Though I must say, that castle arouses suspicion. Yeah, and so do you. <laughs> I am but a humble merchant. Here? Oh, forgive my manner. Massive. Call me the Duke. Now to business. Weapons, ammunition, healing salves, anything you desire, I can provide. You're massive. Oh, yes. Right, shop we can buy additional power. I can now offer an expanded weapon modification service. No, I've got nothing to sell. I can sell the mine, but I still won't actually have enough Take money. Care. Next time, buddy. It's huge.
I hope the microphone's picking my voice up. I might have to switch to um, using a headset with a decent microphone on it, which I don't have. <laughs> I could use the um, the microphone in the wireless headset I'm using, but it's it's a terrible microphone. It might be the only option there. be here. Bella, Cassandra and Daniela. As I was say, sure that would work. Like that. <laughs> yes. Hmm. When they delivery one male for three female mother Miranda meeting with Mr. Stem Sword the Duke business. Just locked. Oh, that's not locked. But okay. No, that's not what I want. There. So, I really want to look for... Hmm. I'm uh, just looking for a safe point now because I need to wrap this up. Typical. <laughs> Can I destroy the bust? Oh, the bust can destroy me. I can see why everyone was thirsting after Lady Dimitrescu. <laughs> wow. I don't know when the last checkpoint is there. <laughs> oh, lucky. I think we found a safe room. I'm getting safe room music vibes. What's this one then? A Norshtins Labyrinth? Craftsman, a craftsman of the late 19th century Northern, I can't say that, North Tyne, was branded as a heretic in his homeland. He wandered the lands until he settled in a remote village, uh, then created four labyrinths the castle, the house on a hill, the water wheel and the iron tower. Upon their completion, he put a gun to his temple and took his own life. 
Each labyrinth is unique and requires its own especially crafted metal ball to operate. Each one contains crystallized human remains which are said to be Neustin's four beloved wives. The labyrinths are the graves. Wow. Looks like there's a hole for something here. Oh yeah. Oh wow. Right, well, we're going to save and we're going to wrap up this episode. So thank you very much for watching. And I will catch you on the next one. Cheers, everyone. Bye. Whoa. This looks so good.